in the 207 kitchen at Omain Studios with Chef David Turin, David's restaurant, and you just renovated your South Portland location. We did, yeah. David's open. I mean, David's 38 in South Portland. All Closed right. For about three weeks, and we are back at it. Back open. Better than ever. Yeah. Okay, so. so what are we making here? So this is one of my all-time favorite desserts. It sounds super simple. Chocolate pot of creme, little chocolate pot of cream, right? All right. And uh, you know, it's the best chocolate pudding, bar none, and super easy to make. All right, so. Get right into this. So you get a little, this is just a little bit of cream. Okay. A little bit of sugar. Super simple. Just pour it in. Look at that. It's just sitting in my car. I mean, you say super here. simple. That. Can't get the sugar Until it the freezes bowl, in the car. That's right. A <laughs> uh, little sugar, and this is a little bit of chocolate, right? Okay. And this is a Calibo. They call it Calibo 811, which is just, if you buy the chocolate drops in your grocery store, it's probably that chocolate. Okay. Like the baker's chocolate, essentially? Or? Well, it's not baker's chocolate. It's, it's chocolate morsels, but it's, but it's just Calibo. And it's, okay. a, it's a really good baking chocolate. Okay. All right, so we've got this. And what I'm going to do with this is just um, basically bring this to a boil. That melts quickly. Well, I had the cream already hot. Okay. And it's not that much cream. So this is enough for, for like eight of these little dishes or four plus a little special way to do this. So, all right, so we're going to bring this literally to a hard boil. And over Why do you here, want it to boil? Well, it's actually going to get a little thicker. So okay. it's going to cook the cream and the sugar and the chocolate. It's just going to reduce just a little tiny bit. It just like has to hit the boil for like a minute or two. And then I've got some egg yolks. So this is, uh, this is like four egg yolks right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically pour the hot cream into the eggs. And then I'm going to add a little vanilla and we're going to be done. But okay. It's, it's really the easiest That's to That's it. Set. All right. So here we are. We're just about done. All right, and you can see this is boiling. It's boiling pretty hard. Yes. And that is it. So, all right, if you would just move that, you just move that on. You move got that, it. Those egg yolks around a little bit. Move them around. Oh, yeah, okay. Stir it. Okay. There we go. Yeah, just keep them stirring. There we go. All right. Oh, this is going to be tricky to see if you can spatula the rest of that chocolate out of there. Oh, okay. All right, go ahead. Oh, you're a star. Look at that. All right. Okay. Ooh, take that, Robbie C. So, all right. And then sometimes the chocolate will have like little lumpies in it. Mm -hmm. So if you want, you can use like an immersion blender, a little hand blender to get them out, or you can just whisk like mad to get. Use your out. own hand there immersion blender. Okay, so I, mean, I got chocolate. Over. If you don't get chocolate all over yourself, then you haven't. Really done. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna put these in the in the chocolate pots, right? Okay. And probably like, oh, look at this. I'm doing great. I got it all yeah, on the counter, nailing this. on the napkin. Listen, okay. it's fine. These all are right. cute little containers. Okay, they're really cute. You could use like espresso cups or coffee cups. All right, and the reason I'm putting the rest of this in a bowl is because I'm going to chill it, and it's going to come out just so perfect to make little balls of chocolate. All right, okay. so mine, don't mind the mess right here. I'm going to okay. put this in the blast freezer over here. and. Magically, in the other door, the other door. Ta-da! Here we go. Ta here the we go. magic of All television. All right, there we go. All right. So these were in the refrigerator like two hours. Okay. Overnight, oh, just fine. Bad. And so here you have, you have little chocolate pot de creme. All right. So it's a cold pudding. So, you know, the classic thing is you just take a little whipped cream and you put a little of this on there. Right? Homemade, of course. Of course. Delicious. This actually has rum chata in it. Oh. But, yeah, rum liqueur. All right. And I'm not a big fan of, uh, of you know, non-functional garnish, but I happen to really like the way mint tastes on this, right? So you can put a little mint on there. I think a lot of people would enjoy mint. But, you know, a big, old hunk of, a big old hunk of mint leaf, like a whole mint leaf, you know. Not your thing. Mint, right. All right. You got a little chocolate shaving. Okay. So this is just some chocolate that I shaved off and a little uh, green crumb de menthe. Right. Ooh. Okay, you get the idea. Okay, right, so we have the idea. That's one version. Okay, so now, uh, you know what I did? I forgot to put the, uh, in the blast chiller, I'll put that vanilla. The vanilla. vanilla goes we in. Go. We let the vanilla. Don't forget that. Don't forget the vanilla. Okay, okay, so here you have a little piece of pound cake, right? All right, let's just put that here. So what I have right here, this is just a spoon in a warm, in a warm dish of water. Okay. All right? And just watch this. This just kind of comes out so Ooh. perfect. Just roll that right up. Just roll it right on there like that. Right? Now warm because it won't stick? Is that yeah, the idea? So, okay. Yeah, just come out. And then you've got a little of this really oh. soft with cream. And you can do the same thing on here. But I, I'm just telling you, when you eat this chocolate, uh, and I mean pound cake, I don't even care. Like, you know, you can use a little, you know, a little store-bought pound cake, you know, and put a little butter on it and saute it in a Teflon pan yeah. so it's a little No warm. need to get too crazy with this. So delicious. Okay. And, and then there it is right on top. Okay. Which one are we trying? 
well, sir. As you know, the chocolate's the same thing. It's a good choice, like so, fork, <laughs> fork with the chocolate. All right, pudding, you go for that, I'll go for this. Okay. All, All right, right. You and you can find the recipe to this in the 207 section of our website. There we go. Yeah. David Turin, thank you so much. Oh, that's so good. It's pretty chocolatey, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's rich. All yeah. right, 207, we'll be right back. Thank you.